Hey guys, welcome back to another typography tutorial in After Effects. Today I will be teaching you how you can make this kind of typography style edit. So let's dive into the tutorial. So I will be using this clip for the tutorial and I have already marked the beads. So we will start by adding a camera layer. Right click and add a camera layer. Here is my camera settings in case you want to copy it. Now add 3 to 4 null layers. Now turn on 3D and motion blur on all the layers including the text and the clip. Now parent the camera layer to the null layers. Once you have connected all the null layers, enter the text in the text layer and reposition it by pressing P on the text layer. Now duplicate the first text layer and change the word. Now reposition this text layer where you want your next text to appear. Now you can use a simple text animation preset on both the text layers. I will provide link to my text preset in the description in case you want to use that. Now we will begin with the camera movement. Click on the first null layer and press P and Shift R simultaneously. To open the position and rotation values on the first null layer, now keyframe position and the Z rotation. Now just follow me with the values. Once you have set the second keyframe, select all the keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. Then open the graph panel. Under the graph panel, click on position and you should see a graph like this. In case you don't have this kind of graph, right click and click edit speed graph. We are done with the first camera movement. Now click on the second null layer and press P and Shift R to open position and rotation. Keyframe position and Z rotation such that these keyframes are behind the keyframes of the first null layers. As you can see the position and Z rotation keyframes are behind the keyframes of the first null layer. You should overlap keyframes like this for smooth camera movement. Now we will repeat the same process for all the camera movement. Remember to overlap keyframes for smooth camera movement. I wanna burn all the bridges between us
for 360 degree rotation i will be just using one null layer Now that we have a smooth rotation of around 360 degrees now I will place the words where I have marked the beats I have duplicated the text layer now reposition it in such manner that it covers the entire screen I will also be adding a white line under the lyrics so for that make a solid of white color unlink the scale and make the values 100 and 1 don't forget to enable motion blur and 3d on the solid layer you just added now there is a simple way to adjust the position of the line you just added just click on the text layer and copy the position of the text and paste the same position on the line for example in this case i copied the position of the word i know and pasted the same position on the line now you just need to change the rotation and place it below the word now repeat the same step for the other words So I will start by adding glow to the characters duplicate the layer with the characters and now add deep glow to the bottom layer I will also customize the text by adding drop shadow and deep glow to it Next I will be customizing the background for that make a new solid layer and place it in the bottom add gradient ramp and customize your colors
you might have sharp edges like these because of adding deep glow to the characters. To fix it, just reduce the radius. Now it's time to add some particles and optical flares. I will be providing link to the particle tutorial in the description in case you want to learn that. Points in blaming you, you did not know. Oh. I thought you were the one for me, that's why I give you everything. As you cross by the stormy seas, of you meant the world to me. So yes, that's it for the tutorial. I hope I was able to teach you something new. If you have any queries or suggestions, please let me know in the comments section. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.